Hey everyone, in the previous video we have learned how to get documents. Today we're gonna learn how to get real-time updates from the documents. To get real-time updates, you need to use on snapshot function instead of any kind of get function like get doc or get docs. So let's use that. We will be listening for any kind of changes in our posts collection. So for that, we will go to our page.js file for the home page. So add slash page.js and we're going to use client component. We cannot use server component because this requires JavaScript and server component doesn't come with JavaScript, but client components do. So I will copy this use effect and comment this one because the logic is pretty similar. So instead of using this get docs function, we're going to use on snapshot function. So on snapshot and we're going to pass the post collection ref. It could be a document ref if you want to get real time update from a single document. And then you need a callback function. And this callback function will give us the snapshot as parameter. And we can just move this logic to here. And instead of post collection snapshot, we can use snapshot, then docs.map. And then from the map, we are getting the list of data. And then we are setting the state on this statement. So let's see if that works or not. I will go to the home page again. So we have this post. I will update one of the posts from the console. So I can update this one, this one's title. I can add by on -tune and then update. And now if I go back to the page, now you see the title is also updated. So we are getting real time updates. And this on snapshot function will give you a unsubscribe function to close the connection and you will not see any more updates. So unsubscribe and we need to call this unsubscribe function whenever the components get unmounted. So use this as a cleanup function like this. So that should be it and your app should still work fine. And this is how you can get real-time updates from Firestore. I hope this video was helpful to you. In the next video, we will learn how to update documents. Until then, stay safe and goodbye.